Welcome everyone, my name's Dom and I get a rant for you today. Okay, so I know there's been a lot of like focus on Nintendo Switch stuff on the channel recently and you know what, that's not necessarily a bad thing, right? A lot of the stuff in the past has been focused on like Apple sh PlayStation 5 and Xbox, that kind of stuff, right? And so Nintendo needs some representation and in the regards of the Nintendo Switch, which just got announced as a recording this, the OLED Nintendo Switch. We wanted the Switch Pro, and obviously there's the rant I did about the Switch Pro where I got some stuff messed up. It's not important. What's important for this rant is I noticed something, and I'm pretty sure everybody else noticed that too, on the Switch trailer, the OLED Switch trailer. And that is, they had white versions of these. These are Joy-Cons, and Joy-Cons are not good products. They are clever products, but they are not good products between Joy-Con drift being kind of one of the biggest upsets when it comes to the f Switch. There is another issue that I have had with my Switch, and I have my Switch here. So before you go thinking, oh, oh, Dom, you know what? No, nah, those issues don't actually exist. You just have some busted ones. Let me show you something. I'm gonna prove you wrong, okay? So here's this purple one, and then here's this orange one, and then here's this pink one, and then here's this green one, and then here's this blue, and here's, and then, yeah, I have all the colors. I have all the colors. I have even the gray ones. I have all the colors, and two Pro controllers too. I am fully in the Nintendo ecosystem. I have multiple docks. I got the stupid Ethernet LAN USB jack thing. I am in on the Nintendo Switch game. I'm telling you. I even have the branded, I'm not going to pull it out because it's going to disable the Switch, but I actually have the Toad Mushroom memory card. I don't know if you can see it. It's red. See, I'm looking at the, yeah, that's the actual first party Nintendo Switch branded memory card. I think it's like 128 gigs. I don't know what it is. It's not important. So to get into the issue with these stupid Joy-Cons, they don't stay connected to the Switch. They, especially the right one, it just doesn't connect. It's just not connected to it. So when I'm using it in portable mode, it's just not connected. And that's not just with the great one. That's all of them. Now, newer ones don't seem to have that issue. And you can go online and you can say, okay, yeah, here's the fix. Yeah, it's broken. So you got to unpair it and then repair it. That's not the point. The point is that the stupid Joy-Cons pair themselves when you put them on the stupid rails and the Switch doesn't recognize them. And I know I'm not the only one out there that has this problem. This, in combination with Joy-Con drift, makes these very innovative pieces. They're not perfect. They're not the greatest things for all hands. But considering the versatility you get out of them, like, 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 screw the stupid whatever vibrator motor things, like, those things aren't, you know, they're good, whatever. Just the fact that these are multiple controllers that become one controller, that become two controllers, that have the little lights on the thing, and then you also have the little things, and you put them on, then you could play like this, and so you could play, like, all the different party games that Nintendo offers, which are amazing that so you'd want to play you instantly have access to having multiple people but for seventy dollars for seventy dollars for a set of these joy cons for them to have the issues that they do you know what it ruins your gaming experience it doesn't it doesn't like ruin it to the point where it's the end of the world but it is definitely like it's annoying it is incredibly annoying it is incredibly inhibitive it is just one of those things it's just like why why is this thing that connects the act of it getting paired is the fact that it goes onto the console so when it's on the console you would just assume that it's always connected but it's not it's not and that is i have all these hold on I have all these colors. They all do it. They all do it. And you know what? I love the colors. I'm obsessed with the colors because the you can you can make it. If I wanted to make it, uh, let's say, uh, blue and dark blue and light blue, I can make it that. I want to make it green and pink, which I think is how it's sold. But you can mix and match. And then they even have individual units for the other side, which actually are the Joy-Cons I don't have. I think they have. So this is like the left side. You know what? This is the left side one. And they have a right side one. You get the same color. And then you have the limited edition ones. My, my girlfriend, Erin, she has, I got her the Animal Crossing edition, right? And that has like special Joy-Cons that are Animal Crossing edition. And she's scared to use them because she's scared of them getting broken and getting Joy-Con drift and disconnecting and all this madness, all of it from happening to those stupid Joy-Cons. And they're limited edition, so you can't get them without getting another Animal Crossing Switch. So this rant is to simply tell you, Nintendo, the Switch is great. It's a cool console. But these Joy-Cons, these white Joy-Cons, which I am gonna get, they better work. They better work the way that all the Joy-Cons should have worked. All this mess that I just made that are probably now they all have drift because I threw them on the floor. And so I conclude this rant with that. I will be looking, Nintendo. I will be looking for any issues. And if they are nothing short of flawless, I'll be back. Deal? We're good? Capiche? Good. For anyone who has ever had an issue with their Joy-Cons, let me know down in the comments below. Throw a like on this video if you've ever had any issues with your Joy-Cons at all. And definitely, if you're new here, subscribe. Check out some of my other rants as a playlist somewhere. And I say this all the time. 
please share this video. It helps the channel out a lot. And as always, talk to you soon.